Hello everyone and welcome back. You know I was uh, I had a little extra time I was waiting for actually I was waiting for a chiropractor appointment and I stopped into one of the thrift stores that was pretty much right next door and uh, going through there if you know anything about Melissa or I we always love cooking with cast iron and I've got several cast iron pans and this one was there for sale and this is a Griswold a number 10 and they wanted $30 for it and for me if I go to any of the thrift stores uh, we buy I bought a lot of cast iron there usually you know $10 or more that's you know that's about it otherwise they're kind of screwing you over but since this was a Griswold it's a number 10 it has the bigger logo on the back and I have a number 9 Griswold right here that I actually bought at another thrift store oh, a couple of years ago and this one I think I paid, I don't know, $10, $12 for. Anyway, I'm usually the kind of person that, okay, a cast iron pan is a cast iron pan. You're just going to cook in it. It's fine. It's, it's, the Griswold is amazing. <laughs> and I'm usually not the kind of person to say that. This one needs to be uh, seasoned again. Uh, this one over here, the new one that I just bought, really needs to be seasoned. But things cook so nice, I just can't explain it. So anyway... So this one here was, like I said, $30. I looked it up online. The closest I could find it on eBay, I found it from $199 to $245. So obviously these vintage Griswold cast iron pans, people must really like them. Anyway, I don't know. I am not trying to push anything at all, but it, it was just an amazing difference between even like a lodge a cast iron pan versus cooking on a Griswold. I can't explain it. So... Anyway, not bad. $30 for a $200 pan, and I don't know if I'm going to keep this one at home or bring it up to the tent. I don't have any Griswolds up at the tent, and every time I cook here at home with cast iron, I always use my number 9 here. <laughs> None of the other ones get used. Okay, everyone. Well, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, at least this one for me is just another great thrift store find of the day. We'll see you guys on the next video.